Hello. In the previous video, you looked at different types of news segments. In this video, we're going to look at the conversational style that broadcasters use to connect with the audience. They do this by doing three things. Using short and simple sentences, using a lead-in sentence, and using contractions. People who broadcast the news have to do something that's quite difficult. They have to read a script, but not actually sound like they're reading a script. They need to sound like they're having a personal conversation with the person who's watching the TV. To do this, the script is written in a much more conversational style than in print media. The first example of a conversational style is using short and simple sentences. Sentences need to be short and simple because the viewers only get one chance to hear what's being reported. They don't have the opportunity to go back and read the sentence again like they do in print media, so they have to understand it the first time. An example of the difference is, in print, you might read this sentence. The police have been conducting a house-to-house -house search in a continued effort to apprehend the suspects. While in broadcasting, it's changed to, the police are still looking for the suspects. The second way that broadcasters try to create a conversational style is by using a lead-in sentence. This is the first sentence of the segment and acts as a summary to let the viewer know the subject and the feeling of the report. For example, if a broadcaster begins by saying, more bad news from the stock market, the viewer knows that the subject is financial, stock market, and the feeling is negative, bad news. On the other hand, if the broadcaster begins by saying, a dog owner is very thankful tonight, the viewer knows that the subject is something that happened to a dog, and the feeling is positive because people are thankful when something good happens. A third way that broadcasters create a conversational style is by using contractions. When we have a conversation, we often use contractions or shortened versions of words in our speech. For example, instead of saying will not, we say won't, or we say I'm instead of I am. We normally use contractions instead of the word not, or when we are using the verb to be. So as we can see, will not becomes won't. Have not and has not become haven't and hasn't. Do not is don't. And is not and are not become isn't and aren't. For the verb to be, I am becomes I'm. He is, she is, and it is become he's, she's, and it's. And finally, we are, you are, and they are are spoken we're, your, and their. So, instead of saying a store owner says he is leaving and he will not be coming back, a broadcaster who is trying to create a conversational style will say a store owner says he's leaving and he won't be coming back. In this video, we looked at the ways that broadcasters use conversational style to connect with the audience, using short, simple sentences, using a lead-in sentence to let the audience know what to expect, and using contractions.